Big foot Hello, four, everybody. 305 pounds. You're, You're not going to pick off any. NFL on EA Sports. Sure, I will. <laughs> We're on to the divisional round now. <laughs> All right, Two see steps you, away from playing on the biggest stage in sports. It's the Chiefs going up against the Titans. Have you guys um, that, researched to this? Um, We're standing by subject. in Nashville, our brand new guy. Thank you, Larry. Uh, we welcome right. everyone to the Music hmm. City. Just a stone's um, throw from the Country should. Music Hall of Fame. We are at Nissan Stadium in Nashville, Tennessee. Oh, Coming up, it's yes. divisional round Saturday. Oh, We've got an AFC have three, battle like on tap like between the Kansas City Chiefs, Chiefs and the Tennessee oh, Titans. She's not an adult Hello, actress. everyone. She's As the postseason continues here on EA Sports, we're pleased to bring it to you. Alongside Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon, And who has the edge here? Oh, yeah. You no, know, I've been on had some extra on rest, but another comes in off um, a win but no actually no right? really it's funny has, like, depending on which cat, team you are you say that that's like, an advantage you'll really, take the rest you'll like, take really the week care, off like, get your guys cats, healed up a little I, bit like, and ready to go but that week, team that's coming week, in off of a win last week they're really excited last. to keep playing they feel like they are hot mm -hmm. and ready yeah, to go okay jenna hayes looks too much like my freshman biology teacher dude jenna hayes is fucking hot as shit who's the other one lily lily carter yes The first of four berths in the conference championships on the line here as divisional weekend of the NFL she is underway. Me of this is taken just Not shy of the like 10 here. Past, uh, and he'll take it past the 25 and up to the 28 yard line. So out comes this Amira offense Adara. to take over for the first time. And a look here at their go to guy under center. She's all right. She's all right. You know who it is? Yes, I know who that is. Yeah. Do you know who Tory Black is? It, please tell me. Oh, boy. It's boring. It's boring. Now a play fake here if she, on oh, if, oh, if it's yeah. in the top, if she's in the top, top ten. And his first look is complete. was like number one for the long time. Her and uh, Dylan Harper, I think. And here's the offense today that Harper's hopes to get off to a strong oh, start. Man. That's what, this is my point exactly. If you're in the top ten, it's fucking yeah, I don't really watch much of the girls that are on the top of ten. Actually, both of the so girls that I and love are already retired and shit. But Jenna Hayes is a Oh, there it is. It's like fine one. It's like fine one. Jenna Hayes. Who is that another girl? She, she was a couple like, of cheats there to bring him down. Everybody loves her, and I don't see the. And now the peak at the no. starters on the defensive side. It's so funny when I was in like when I was in high school and. I was a junior and just uh, seniors were in my class with calculus or some shit. And uh, fuck, like if the teacher would leave their room, spot, we were, <laughs> the seniors would always fucking just. Oh, <laughs> they no. would just like shout out names of porn stars. <laughs> and they were usually like no porn stars. And it was like the funniest fucking thing in the world. And the fucking other teacher would leave and the doors would be open. <laughs> and then they'd just be like, um. Well, maybe like uh, uh, what's, what's a good diamonds, one? Right? Good one. <laughs> but it also bursts pipes. Oh, and on that one, that's two. what they get. Yeah, they yeah, get yeah. They say yeah, Brandy Love. Yeah, you just had to chuck yeah. it away. Yeah, she, she, they say Brandy Love. They say Brandy Love. Now is the number six on point. He'll kick it away after a three and out. Is it a bad that we're both looking at the top down? Riley Reed. That's her name. That's her name. Riley Reed. I think. Thank you. Fuck yeah, she has a else bush, bro. I can't fuck with the bush. It's just taking like, around the 12. I can't do it <laughs> we'll call that a punt of 50. Mia Khalifa, overrated. Abella Danger, number four, though. She's actually pretty fire. So here are the Chiefs now coming out for their opening uh, drive. Danny Dan. And they'll be let out by their third year quarterback. And uh, who is Emmy Willis? I've never heard of Emmy Willis. Oh my god, that fucking Mexican dude is number 15. They'll come out in the pistol. Forty El Nino Polo. No, I'm gonna run the option left. And he's got some space here. He's probably gonna run there on first down and it'll leave him with a second. What's the other one they would always reference? Oh man, that wasn't fun. What's your fucking name? The boom. Lisa Ann. They'd always say Lisa Ann. They would have one for a while. He retired. Only a nice tackle prevented it from maybe going all the way. Fuck yeah. 
Johnny Sims is number six. He used to actually get Johnny Sims. He used to go. He used to Tom Brady of the of the adult game. Johnny Sims is a fucking big white ball guy. Yes. 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 He's always paying the school, 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 the
Yo, Big you're literally supposed to snow them, bro. To stop him cold. Nothing there. Yeah, when you talk about My weather app says, about those defensive tackles, yeah, those nose tackles. it's been shitty all week. It says Friday, high of 34, low of 19. And the play snowing. Fake. Hey, fuck, in the middle of the desert in Arizona. Incomplete. He had his hands on it, but couldn't pick it. Oh, no. But it's now fourth down. <laughs> Man, that was close. The opportunity to change momentum, big play, right in his hands, unable to come down with you, it. Oh, you're not doing it right, no on offense if that fell harmlessly to the ground. Even if you didn't put it on pole, you'd probably get fucking turn one. Like on always. Now is the Titans Dude, I've never seen anyone with the worst a luck of his than first. you. I'm not even I was right. I was right behind Miami, Man Man, and fucking whoever else, and I literally oh saw Man Man take a hard wreck. right, and then Miami's car the was slipping. I saw the wreck. That was so nice bad. Like, he literally went teams. off the track, the and then he comes back the on and collects Miami. But I honestly, Miami, I've never seen anyone in the history of our league. Like, yes, there and will the be, like, wrecks just because of the field racing and shit. And then they just fall in the fourth. But and I, what they have to build off of, great confidence right now. Being able to stuff someone on a three and out, you feel like you're in control now. You're doing the dictating. They want to see if that can continue as this game progresses. Will it continue? We'll see. <laughs> and they'll go with a ground attack here. And he'll take this one up to about the 13. He'll get a nice chunk there on the first down run, and it's second and four. First play of the drive. Let's give credit all around. Excellent blocking. But the guy carrying the ball, he was the finisher. <laughs> a really nice run. <laughs> oh, I have no idea why you have. Now they'll throw here out of the gun. And he slings one that's incomplete. Every raise. It literally, I and I've never seen that. I have and never seen a guy because, like, be we have all been in wrecks. They like, we have all pretty much really, been really in well. at least Fly one wreck this whole entire year. You but it, you, for it, some well reason, it's the like you're front. like a magnet. I've never seen it. I've never seen that. And, the and that's why I feel the first so down. bad because After it's like I've never seen this happen to anybody. Like, to anybody. Become looking at that you want to set up a throw, finding time. He's got his man on the crossing route, uh, and he's able to get this one up to the 45 yard line. A gain of 32 that time. Good use of the pass there to pick up the first down against a defensive look that they had specifically yeah. prepared for. They told us coming into this one. Certainly seems like they're holding um, all the right cards now, doesn't it? About because of I... their preparation. Went back, watched the she tape, studied hot. the tendencies, mm -hmm. and they felt like they had them down cold, really nice and they were able to use the pass against them. So after that big gain, let's see what else the She's offense has fine. up its sleeve. Yo. That picture with uh, Matt Andrews. And to give this time to the tailback. And he'll fight his way forward. I can't lie. Forty-eight yard line. Give him three on first. What down. were you doing with your hair? A second and seven. Well, I think we know by now that every run about? is not going to be broken. They get all the way to about the end zone. But these short ones your still have their with, value. Uh, you can Matt still set up the play action and throw the What were you doing with your hair? The and no beard. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, that's and why, and why the the I like. I go with short hair and a short hair complete to his tight end. That catch good for only a yard, and it'll be third down. Oh, so the good. strategy was you evident there. Mean. Get it to your tight end and make it a one-on-one. I one think he is. Yeah. <laughs> no, but pretty much. The tight end, but not there. <laughs> not in this situation. How about the corner? No, pretty much like. Logic and make it a really nice tackle. It'll be a gain of six, and it'll be fourth down. There's so many times you hear today's NFL described as a space game. Get your best players in the space with the football in their hands. That's why sometimes you swing it out to your runner, get him out in the flat, and let him but have no, a chance to I make pretty people much, miss an open I've field. I've changed my looks very much a lot. Like, when I have, like, longer hair, I'll probably go, like, without the beard. And then, like, when oh, I have, you have longer hair. Oh, this dude, is I actually found a picture today that's the old as shit. Oh, line. my God, dude. You want to see me with long-ass hair? Oh my god, Pete Tom, what happened uh, working their way back onto the field. in yeah, October 30th, 2017? You were literally fucking bald. Look at that play sheet. 
and go to a spot oh, I was that they being haven't gone before. Time to shake things up a little bit to try and get this offense moving. Okay, so how do you do that? Because there's sure? no way that's you. You look at what yeah, you called before. Wait, realize the that I just sent you. There's no way that's you. Yeah, that's me. One of your better players, and maybe try and hit something big and get things going in the excitement. Oh my God, motherfucker! No way. Yeah. But it appears that they read man defense and went to the. God, what the fuck is that? I know, dude. My hair was so long. <laughs> you have a goddamn fucking squirrel's nest on your head. I look like Chase from Zoe 101. Yeah, you do. <laughs> That's gotta go to Paul. <laughs> no, don't. I want to see what Paul says about it. And he's gonna go down. He backed up into the end zone, and this is gonna wind up a safety. So how, many, how many years ago was that? That was 2008. When you make it look like man-to-man -man coverage so and then the corner, yeah. off the corner, big plays often result, and it sure did on that one. That's a 15-year-old peak on? Literally. And then look at me as an After adult the safety, now. After remember, they also <laughs> need to give up the football, and here's the free kick. And he fields it cleanly. Yo, Miami, I was right behind you at Russia. We both break beautifully in the turn one. We're turning. And they'll yeah, be man. looking to avoid what happened last so time, which is putting the football. Shit. But when you look at how teams <laughs> play the game, that complimentary football, Comes into play. Oh, I, I was dying. Defense. How do I take care of my offense? Well, the defense is taking care of them in a lot of ways. Now it's time for the offense to jump things up and help the defense out. Give them a little bit of rest. Yeah, time, time for them to give them a rest. Took the words right out of my mouth. And he'll get this up to about the 40. A nice run there, nine <laughs> I yards. Felt so bad. I felt down. so bad. Because you know I really, I've never seen line. that with anybody. But the guy that is carrying the ball behind them I'm, I'm can create his own space like, and break a tackle. Because everyone in this league has at least been involved in some sort of wreck. But I'm just like, how does this guy every single week always seem to get wrecked out? But everybody else, it's like fine, you know, and they'll have like their one wreck here and there. But Miami, just, I just don't get it. And on the ground they go with the running back. And to the 42-yard yeah. line here and brought down there. Two yards on the pick up there, but it's enough to give them a new set of downs. The defense came out with a look that they had prepped for all week to attack. They took advantage, got the first down. And the key words in there, prepped for all week. They really studied them, understood their tendencies, right. knew what they liked to do, and prepared their game plan accordingly. And boy, the payoff was good. Now on first down, he'll drop to throw it. Quick throw, that's complete on the inside slam. Give him nine there on the first down completion. Oh, I don't know. And boy, they had high praise for this rookie receiver when we asked the coaches about him, didn't they? They certainly did, and obviously they liked his measurables, otherwise they wouldn't have brought him on to the team. Height, weight, speed, all of that. But how about what oh, they yeah, really you said? Competitiveness. Six, that's what they really liked about six, him. The way he goes six, after the football, six, competes six, for it, and decides when it's in the air, it's four his shit, and bro. only his. And no escaping this time as he'll go down. They got him for a sack. He'll go in the books as a seven yard loss on the sack. And it's third down. And they brought the pressure there just right up the gut, didn't they? Yeah, they certainly did. And you know, when you've got so many different responsibilities as an offensive line, Austria you got to deal with the well. nose tackle, the two defensive tackles or ends, and then sometimes you just can't account for everyone. The linebacker slipped free. Third down at eight now. Mm -hmm. Google fucked up the whole thing. Out of the gun, they'll look to throw. Oh, he's got a man wide open. What, where is it? Suzuka? It's, it's not telling me anything. Yeah, it says no hourly 44 cash available. It's the exact right word. Over 
over the Monday, middle. There's so, almost so always far, traffic, so anytime you're a receiver in that Suzuka area, you're not just focused me on catching or the football. She. You're wondering where the collision's going to come Ooh. from, right? Because there's almost always there. someone oh, I got there I got able to concentrate. We're racing on what day? Sunday? And even added a well, little Sunday, little Sunday, Sunday, but it's run. Monday. Give him five on the carry there, and it'll be second down. And that's exactly what you're Are we going off the pan time? Pick up five yeah. yards, bring up second and five. So it's going to be the light five. Line, though, they've got to figure out a way to out leverage the guys up front okay. because the offensive line is winning at the point it of It might time. get some dick, though, because Sunday it says 100% chance of rain. But on Monday, it will be. Yeah, I know, but what if it carries over? Four what so it sets up a big yeah. play here, third and a yard. This will be play number seven on the drive. Third and a oh yard. I can only imagine the rain is Zupa. It's like, Zupa's already part of the line. That's Second why I love it. Backers, third level defensive backs. On that run, that was what we call a first level run, and it was stopped by a second level player. That was a nicely run slant route, and what the receiver's trying to do is make the defender think he's going I to field. I had grinded so myself. I mean, uh, as much for me, I was in D for the longest time, and I was fed up with fucking field, being in D class, and I sat there for a good three hours, man, going from D to S. It was the most the awful really experience nice I've ever had. It says Monday that it's going to be clear, so... That it's going to be clear. So it be clear. They'll run it now, out of the gun. Down to about the 22 here. He wipes out. You get a lobby with like four people at the end. back to Whoa. second and seven. We are watching a runner having a really nice game. Carrying it very well. Everyone does. Is the Look at the help he's getting. Offensive line, I think they're pretty eager to block for him. Quick hitter here, it's complete. Six yards is the pickup, and that'll lead to a third down. Oh, and just play after play after play on this long drive this for the game. offense. Honestly, it, it's just dead in general because not a lot of people. Here in this AFC like, a lot of people like F1. The weekend the is where it's and the weekend right is where I see message. the most lobbies now. The NFL like if you go, sports is brought to you by if you <coughs> really like racing in F1, and back now with Charles just like most people on F1, I'm, like I'd say it's like 50 kind of split if you have a controller or a wheel. I feel like most people just play high racing. They haven't hit rigs, they don't really play consoles. Yeah. Okay, no score on that play, but this guy's been a touchdown machine all year long. You know they trust him with the football. So the run gets him the first, and now they operate with a fresh yeah. set of downs. Yeah. Yeah. Now back to throw. Finding his safety valve here. That's complete. So a good spin move there before he's taken down. A nice little game. Everyone so who's watched any racing videos on him get your best players in the space with the football in their hands. Yeah, That's like why sometimes you swing it out to your runner, get him out in the flat, and let him have a chance to make people miss an open field. Yeah, he never took a lot of GT or and the seemingly endless drive continues. Now whistles and a flag down. Looked like one of the chief linemen might have moved. A long drive here. Play 12 coming up for the offense. I'm getting drunk tomorrow night. He'll look to throw. That's caught at the one. And I he'll be think I've gone out right every Friday. The goal line at about the one yard line. And just a small glimpse there as to why they like this rookie. And so then much. I got to get up early to watch the Ohio State. And, and, and when we talked about him, and, and, yeah, 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 they like his work ethic. You know, this guy's running every route. Ohio State is getting better at it all the time. Really only got to take some back. Now they'll run it on the toss. 31 seconds. Losing yardage back to the three. He lost two and it brings up four. Against Michigan. So I got it. Y'all win. Oh, I am talking so much shit to Paul. You have no unit. idea. And sometimes it starts to sound a little cliche. But did you show the free safety on that play? We won. We won. We won, we won 62 to 39. And when you have a free safety, you can run like that. You've got to turn it around the same way. 
three to four touchdowns. So a 15 play drive. Can't believe that only resulted in three, but it did. Yes. That is somewhat it's amazing, isn't it? Totally. When you hold the ball that well, I got long, late on this day four years well, ago. I forgot about that. Three points Thanks, on Facebook the board. memories. It has to be a little bit of a disappointment, doesn't it? You just like to remember the date you hit the field and No, but I really... Is it a rare occurrence for you? No, it's one of those things where I can remember dates and stuff, and there's a 43-year-old woman that I got with. Five years ago. You got laid by a 43 year old you were 21. Yes. He saw it. I'm not kidding. It's almost like a base is clearing. Dude, yes. I don't care. Dude, John. I don't care. She was 21 and she was 38. She was 43 at that time. Oh, so she, I thought she was 43. <laughs> no. She's <laughs> almost 50. I know. That's what's crazy about it. <laughs> Econ. It's 1 a.m. and I have to go to school. This is horrible. Dude, right? Thank you. <laughs> Y'all are crazy. I find it weird even hooking up with anybody else. I'm like, great. Single, single. Bro, when I was a soft dude, when I was a soft Junior. soft uh, more, I got with the same like, it doesn't really matter. And he finds a man with a crossing round. And he'll get it all the way out near midfield to the 45. He got 20. Everyone says it's almost like 37 and three kids. And next to me, you tell me all the time, I hate experience really quarterbacks because no matter what, you really can't hide what you're doing. And I think that right there, he knew right yeah, away where the sound was way coming from, older. where his primary guy was going to be. And he ended up going to a secondary target. <laughs> yeah. I was just going to ask you, that wasn't the primary target. It, he's so good at that, isn't he? I think he knew right away that he wasn't going to get to his primary guy. I think he read that as soon as he got to the line of scrimmage, knew where the pressure was going to come from, and said, ah, I know how to beat that. And that's what he did. Again, we'll see the pistol here. Fucking man. Man. They'll give it to him. Singapore right proved that. And no room to maneuver there. Give him a oh, yard up to the 47. A couple of cheats there to bring him down. Yeah, That's like, a good play by the guys on the defensive yeah, side of the ball. Held him to a gain of two. Yeah, do and that changes that. the playbook a little bit now that. for the guy calling plays. Yeah, you got your boy cool, man. Now he's got to probably think about yeah. going to the air instead of maybe staying mm -hmm. on the field. They'll set up to throw. Surveying the field. Looking left side, it's complete. He's got it. No, but me, I mean, I do apologize for, for the it's way third I down. And all that. I know many like, people I... like to throw to the tight end, maybe in a little flexed out position because he creates mismatches with his size. But slot receivers do the same thing with their quickness, their speed, and their route running just... savvy. <laughs> Because I come from an IndyCar background, and I don't know if you know anything about IndyCar. Because they drive on more than ovals, and I've been trying to tell that to folks for years that, hey, they don't just drive on ovals. But on third and short, yeah. that's really when you put it out there and tell people who you are. And that's exactly what they did. For the offense, they're looking at their offensive line and saying, guys, where are you? We need you on those plays. Which is fine, except Indy is one of the greatest races ever. And yeah, that is the oval that every oval away. tries to be. And that's what bounds. makes now it's a question Indy where so special. Because I'm from there, at the 11-yard so. line. I was raised loving the Indy 500 because that's my home uh, town race. But it's like they, they have the mentality they there the where it's like a if it's paved, I'm going to drive on it. You know, and that's kind of the mentality that I was born with. You know, like if you don't want me to race there, don't put cement there. You know. What happened? <laughs> Super tall. Monza, and you said you were at Monza. Yeah, the well. in but the wrong you know, but now, that's why when everybody was throwing a fit, it's like you know, like I was just you know, like minus, like I might as well just apologize because even if I try to explain, like, because like my whole thing is like I hate how over penalized. 
F1 on the outside, they're playing press coverage. You know, Tough and day. that's what Tough I don't like right about great racing game. at times. And, you know, but I have yeah, my right. whole thoughts, but it's like, you know, but if that's what you guys want, I'll give it to you guys because I'm not going to start a big old fight in the battle because I know not everyone agrees with the way that I see great with racing, but, you know, that's fine. And I'm going to adapt. And but that was like the only race that I've done that the whole entire year, and, and he uncorks a folks are like, oh, you know, and I'm just like, look, that was just a one yeah, this race thing, right? It was really dumb, and we've all had our races where we've done really dumb shit. And the will come back onto the I'm going field. to apologize for it. I admit ten. that I was in the wrong. The Titans and I'm offense now they get like set to head back out here. And a tight game after and last I had my Russia results disqualified, and I'm taking a 10 place break. Kind of, kind of penalty for the, the pain ring. You gotta feel there's a sense of urgency for them going on offense right now, but they have to do it without letting panic creep in and affect their play. Let's just go ahead and go back through that play with his eyes, because he's got. Because I wasn't keys, doing that the whole right like the before I got hit from behind and got hit by the Alpha Romeo where he hit my front oh, front wing because I wasn't driving like, like that at all until that happened. And pretty much like I'm in a huge pile of shit. If I go and replace my wing, I'm going to lose out spots. I'm going to have to well, climb my way back up there. Third and even and they're going in the wrong I also direction have to, you know, exactly so I just got tunnel to, but you're exactly right. I'm wanting to protect my spot, so I didn't the really free of up, replace my wing. And it's like, I, like I'm going to have to use all of the road to at least maintain some sort of lead. And, you know, it's... I mean, it's still no excuse, but that is one of the main. That is the main here for the Chiefs on third down. Yeah, that situation is almost all of the track. On play action, they'll because throw. Because I was like, if I try to take it normally, I'm just going to get passed. Looks like a nine-yard But I should have just re replaced my front wing. I remember when I was a kid, and all I wanted was, was, was a nickel so I could get that soda down at the fountain. And guess what? The nickel came into play well. Five defensive. They covered well, allowed for the sass. So does were a nickel when you were a kid? No, I just needed the extra nickel oh. so, I could pay the, so I could pay the proper okay, price. Okay, how much were they, a dime? <laughs> what were they? Uh, 15 cents. On now is the Titans punter. As the drive goes backwards, so he's on to punt it away. Averaging over 50 yards of punt so far as this one's away. That's taken it around the 40. 12 yards on the return that time. And the Chiefs will have excellent field position here as they take over. And now here comes right. Kansas City. And on the last go around, they really couldn't get anything going. They had to punt from deep inside their own territory, which means they're going to lose the field position battle as a general rule. What they're looking for now is a little more consistency. Move the ball at least a few times on offense, get a couple of first downs, and hopefully flip the field. Yeah, just something to build off of. That's what they're looking for here. Not too many things get to a quarterback of this magnitude, but I think it's safe to say that pressure can get to any quarterback. Now he's obviously a great franchise quarterback, but felt Because my whole thing, like, because what I was doing is that I was putting it on one throughout the whole entire track. And back. then, like, when he picks up about six place, as he gets like, this down that to the 41. It's that going was a really five. nice run there to bring up the third like, short. I, I need to After the incompletion on first game. down, it's awfully you nice know, to have a running was... back that you can hand it to and put you back in a good situation. And on third and, and three, they decided I was showing, to go you know, yeah. the three yeah, the yeah, early. Right. I was like, this is another reason why I shoot my three. My favorite rival. I'm showing the slap and I'm like, look at what he's doing. As a result, the drive continues. I don't care how many times we see it. I still get a kick out of watching quarterbacks and receivers do the pass trade. The two locker was not in two. I always remember that when we go to practices, we see that after practices as well. They really tune it up, don't they? They tune it up they know why they do it for these situations first down yeah. and they build that trust and that's why they're able to find him in this type of a situation some runs are blocked so well you almost forget that someone has to carry the ball to gain the yardage the leverage by the offensive line to create right. space up front really well done they'll look to throw 
Throwing for his running back, and he's got him complete. Right. Only three there on the pickup, but that's enough to move the chains. I know most of the time when the ball's in the air, you're thinking wide receiver, tight end, but running backs, they can be a big part yeah, of any but passing like The other thing nowadays. that I don't like either, and I'm not saying I do this all of the uh, time. Like, I always try to keep the team in my pass, but some guys, like, if you bang wheels, they're like, that's a penalty. Five yards on the like, catch well, there brings up second yeah, down. Well, yeah. You bang wheels and get taken out, or did he just kind of give gives you a nice little tap and pass it? Because to me, it's like if he gives you just a nice little tap, that's still racing to me. Like, and now shit inside happens. the red zone, the offense will operate. Yeah, right. Hang on now. Boom, landing. Now they'll throw here out of the gun. And a quick throw here. That's complete. That is right. take it on in for a Chiefs touchdown. Their dangerous yes. wide receiver from 17 yards right. out. And the Don't Chiefs have taken the lead. drive them off the track. As a former DB, you might not like to see that, <laughs> but from a wide receiver's perspective, those are the plays they dream of. Exactly. On and counts. that's what I was trying right, to tell the folks. Off. Like, as long I mean, as you're not it, driving them that off the track or take them out of when you actually bang them to chase like, him. It's and fun. it's up like, and good. And some folks think that that's like, it should be a penalty. And I'm like, no. So that drives like, seven plays in length. Wheels and it's still capped space. off with a Kansas City touchdown. <coughs> that's, that's not a penalty. Like, that's just hard-ass racing, you know, and shit happens. Here's the Chiefs kickoff unit now as they'll send this one away. Exactly. And, you know, there this will be taken time to the back of the Austria end zone. And from back there, that a wise move. Run. He'll just sit like on this one. And it'll and come I went back, back to the 25. Side, but we dinged wheels, but I still gave him all of that space to, to the like, field. the point where I wouldn't, like, drive into him or take him out or like anything and talk. They run the counter now like, hey, first down. Mind, and he'll like, fight dude, forward man, to about the crazy. 27 like, yard fun. line. Give him a couple on the carry there. Second you know, and eight. And Two minutes to go here in the first half. Back with more AFC playoff action. Yeah, right at the end of uh, the race. Yeah, it was right at the end and get that money made a move on me and then i went back to the end a reminder, side, as we but did all like through the regular we banged season, wheels we'll but it's like i'm not Ridley forcing him He'll off the track and i didn't analysis take, of this first half take of him out. i didn't want to touch it just happened like it was just one of those things where it's like we're in the final two or three laps and you know this is the third and i have a damaged and ass thing no too to so you know that was just one of those races where yeah, it's third just, down. you know but it's a tried and true that's a good a good example to like show like hey football. like when you're banging wheels to throw this the ball is fine and you what put pressure i on did and with me and pig that's only gonna help your defense yeah he's since being hurried he got rid of it before taking the hit but it's you know Looking to throw, and this time he's got the hookup. It's complete. It's a pickup of 16 there, and it'll lead to a new set of downs. Right. Looking to speed things up here, bro, with some tempo. And, you know, and that's why, you know, the, the few man, like, I really do feel so bad. Like I said, I've never seen this before with anybody. And that'll make it second and like, a foot or I've so. I've done so many league great, great, Races with all types of as he looks to drivers, and I'm just like, yeah, how the? Like, no I've one never seen someone so unlucky on lap one because it's like with everybody else they're fine, but with Miami, like trouble finds him, and he's not even doing anything. And how about the dime look here? Six DBs on third and inches, daring them to run the ball. Back to throw. Now they set up the screen. That's complete. And he's taken down at the 43, but not before picking up the first. And the offense moving quickly to the line. Now on first down, he'll drop to throw it. Quick hitter here, it's complete. And here he'll be brought down a little shy of the 35 at the 36. Right. Seven yards on the play, and that'll make it a second down. The Russia one, and yeah. 
time as he'll go down. They got him for a sack. Now hold everything here. We're going to get a timeout by the offense. It's just their first, so they'll have two remaining here before we get to halftime. And he's got his man on the out route. They do get 12, but they'll be marked short. And that leads to a fourth down. And that was a nice catch, and if the goal was to get into field goal range, it certainly appears that they accomplished that. Well, and sometimes that's what you dial up in these situations, right, when you want three? Well, if the goal was to get into field goal territory, even though it'll be a long attempt, oh, I, know. I think yeah. they accomplished that. And sometimes you have plays for that. It's not always a first down when you want three get a little bit closer, make it an easier shot. Yeah, sometimes you just have to concede to the defense and they know what you're... Now, whistles come in. We're going to get a timeout here by the offense. It's just their first... He's so I'm two remaining here before we get to Break early. I, tell you, I say that every time. Break early when you're following somebody. Like, the breaking point when you're following So they complete the pass and now they face a second now. down. <laughs> it's a five it's receiver so... set. Three to the left. Two to the right. Now a shotgun snap as they'll look to throw. Firing quickly here, and that's complete. Now hold everything here. We're going to get a timeout right. by the offense. So that means they're down to one remaining here as we head toward halftime. Yep, it is. They'll run it now out of the gun. And he'll because get this of that one dirty up air, to about the 39 here. It's a pickup of four, and it'll bring up second down. Not a run that you're going to write home about, but still a good first down run. Now whistles come in. Yep. We're going to get a timeout here by the offense. And with halftime oh, on the horizon, they'll be out of timeouts from here forward. But I definitely got to go to bed, man. I'm glad that we were able to talk and everything. And once again, like, I mean, I, I don't know if so. And welcome back, the offensive unit. They took the timeout. Week. And now they get set I, I to line up so. as we resume action. We're going to be down for the next two. And that is incomplete. 16 seconds now on the yeah. clock. Yeah. Defense thinking pass. Yeah. They've got the yeah, nickel set out on third and six. So what? So we'll get you back. Oh, we'll get you back for USA. They'll run it now out of the gun. There you go. There you go. We get you back to the USA. So, here Austin, as we head toward half and you were at that race too, right? No, I think I think that was somebody else I was talking to that was at that race. I forget who. All right, so the timeout over, and all 11 no, men dude, back so out on the I field for the defense. Go, and I'm three hours away from it. Averaging 50 yards of boot so far as this one's away. Good luck with that. Yeah, this one hits at the one, continues on Good into luck the with end that. zone. I, and I don't mean back. that as like rude or like anything. <laughs> right. And with time running short here, they'll simply take a knee, and that yep. should do it for half number one. Oh, so it's yeah. on to halftime in this so AFC yeah. divisional round matchup. As we'll send you down to Orlando right. as we check right, in man. with Larry Will Ridley at our EA yourself? Sports Hopefully. halftime report. Thanks, Brandon, and welcome to our EA halftime report. I'm Larry Ridley. Here in the playoffs, you hope to have close games where both sides are putting it all on the line. And that's what you we have so far. Yourself, buddy, it right? should be a very yeah, exciting have, second half. I hope you have a good uh, So let's take a look at the highlights from the first half. Here from we go to so. early in the first. The ball's going to come out on the run. Titans will pick up the loose football and score. Titans All right, buddy. now on top. Right. And long. So going to get to the QB once again. This goes for a loss of nine. Chiefs have it on second and five. The quick pass, it's complete, and that goes as an 18-yard touchdown. They go ahead by five. We move late into the second to once again sack the QB. This ends up as a huge loss in yardage.
So that's all for us here at the EA Sports Studio. 